Watch out for the guillotines. Uh, take that off. Oh, you son of a bitch. Piece of shit. And it's a good thing they go down in one hit from that sword. Ha ha, very funny, Mr. Rose. Ow! You motherfucker. I don't think I... I didn't see the fairy anywhere. Oh, God. Okay. Guillotine blades. Is there a pit? Nope. Okay, good. God damn it! You, you keep wasting your bombs like that. <laughs> Not my fault. Just keeps on... Question a guy asks, what are your thoughts on the Knuckles spin-off series? So, I did post a tweet about it. I enjoyed it, um, but I can see why some people have issues with it. They focused a little too much on the Wade character, which, of course, what's her face has to be the center of attention. Watch Navi. out. Navi. Monsters from the sea. Wait a minute. Do we have, um... It's the, it's the Wall Masters. Son of a bitch. And yeah, they'll be coming for you, despite how big this room is. And you gotta use your hover boots, too. Oh, fuck, I do. Alright. And watch out. A wall master's coming for you right now. Nope! Oh, I'm trying to... Fuck you! You piece of Ooh. shit. No, no, no. Oh, my God. No! Not towards the blade. And now... God damn, are they slippery. Oh my god. I hate these things. Oh, Jesus! Snuck right the... F snuck right up on me. Alright. And now you gotta find a Stalfos. Oh, I hate those guys. Okay. I'm gonna switch them off. Um, you can switch off the Lens of Truth yeah, for the time being. Yeah, I need to preserve my magic right now. It's not too hot right now. God! You think defending with your sword is going to prevent you from taking damage? I guess I have to switch to the normal one, don't I? So, uh... The Master Sword. Uh, right. I mean... If, I mean, it's a... I mean, it's your choice. The Master Sword doesn't do as much damage, but you're, you are able to defend yourself. It's basically a pro con. Are you gonna do something? Come on. Cuba says to play the Song of Storms after defeating the Stalfos. All right. Well, I might as well give it a I don't, shot. Go ahead. I don't really see what the point of it is, but hey, let's find out. Uh, where is? It's A down, up, A down, up. A down, up, A down, up. All right. Oh! Okay! You know what? Hang on, hang on, hang on. Do, so, I, have, do I have empty jars? Oh, they're already full. All right. You know what? I will fucking take that. It revived my magic, too. I did too. not know this was a thing in the game. Oh, so, more kudos to you, Cuba. <laughs> kudos to you, Cuba. Alright. Wait, um... Alright, you need to go the other way. Oh, uh, whoops. You, you needed you needed to equip the boots. Now you gotta start all the way back here. Well, hopefully Watch I don't have to... the gold skeletons. Yeah, hopefully I don't have to deal with that goddamn stealthos again. You might have to. Oh, please but you can no. just run away from it. You can just run away from it. Yeah, but he's annoying. Turn around, you piece of shit. There. If you're too impatient with 
when dealing with these, just use your arrows or hook shot. <sighs> oh no! no! You motherfucker! Ouch. I forgot there was one there. Ow! You know what? I will gladly take it. Now back to full health. And... Whoop! So, something that I was actually asked that question about from DICE, and I put some thought into it. This is gonna have to be like a two-parter of a uh, highlight reel. Because there's a lot that goes on. Ha! Weren't fast enough. Oh my god. Slipping and sliding. Yeah, really. Alright, you're gonna need the lens of truth again, because you need to go left and see where the invisible platforms god damn are. It. Oh, son of a bitch. Alright. Just just ignore it. Alright, do I need the hover boot still or no? Yeah. Yeah, you're gonna want the hover boots. Alright, so I'm guessing it's this way. Yep. Alright, here comes no, another. Put away your ocarina. Oh. Yeah, I think. Fuck. I think those. Sights are invisible to the naked eye. All right. So you're definitely going to want your lens of truth on. Let's wait until the blade goes, and and yes, we got more silver ruby collecting. Oh, to do. wonderful! No, stop. There. If you equip the big Oron sword, you can destroy that is, light Navi. motif. Oh. If you use the big Oron sword, you can take it down in one slash. Oh. oh. But like... you've already destroyed it, so it doesn't matter. Yeah. I turn back on. Jesus. And off we go. Where the hell are those goddamn silver... What's this? I saw it glow glowing green. I'm guessing it's uh, the Song of Time again. Kubo would probably. Maybe. Hello. Wait, looks like we have to. Instead of Silver Ruby collecting, it looks like we have to destroy all the enemies. Yeah, it kind of looks. <coughs> kind of looks like it. Alright, I'm guessing there's probably another well, one somewhere. Yep, and it might be invisible. Yep, to the I see it in the distance. Well. No! Ah, damn it! Ouch. Yes. That's just death. Sorry for me too loud, honey. All right. All right. Where's the other one? There it is. <laughs> I just saw it. It's to the right. Further right. Ah. There you are. I know what it is! Oh my god, I hate the controls here. Well, that was, uh, the sound clip from Vector Man. You know Vector Man? Yeah, I actually have a physical copy of that game. I love Vector Man so much. It's yeah. so sad that Sega never brought him back. Makes me wonder why. There's potential in it. In case you're wondering, Cuba, Vector Man was a 1995 Sega Genesis game that was pretty much the rival to Donkey Kong Country in terms of graphical say, yeah. style. <clears throat> and the playing It's basically a run it it's a run and gun, shoot 'em up type of game with a badass soundtrack. And it plays so smooth. It's like it's such a satisfying looking game. Yeah, and it actually had a sequel a year later. But since then, Vector Man completely went off the face of the earth. Honestly, if Sega allowed it, 
He would have been a great Smash Brothers character. No, I think Vector Man would actually make for a good movie adaptation. I mean, the premise is basically like Wally, -E, where um, it's a robot on Earth that has to clean up the planet. Except Vector Man came out 13 years before Wally, -E, so Wally -E stole that idea. Yeah. The chest is invisible. Ah, there we go. Yeah, you'll encounter some invisible chests in this. Arrows. Cool. Okay, so this was rather pointless. What are you doing? Blink. Okay, what is this for? It's like Golden is actively fighting the controls in this game, more so than Link is with the enemies. Damn it. And frankly, that's just... Yeah. I saw that Navi was glowing green, which is why I played the song. All right, you might have to move away first. Ah, there we go. You have to... Nope, you gotta move further away. Well, he's, she's glowing green. But you have to make room for the Stone of Time. Okay. Alright, let's try it now. Da -da 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 <clears throat> There we go. Yeah, if you occupy the same space as it, it won't appear. I guess I was just there to get the hearts. Well, you were already full on health already. Yeah, so it's kind of pointless. And nope. Well, there's nothing else in here, so let's head back. Yeah. And leap! Oh, wait. I gotta go the other way. <coughs> Whoop! <laughs> Link, put your fucking ocarina away. Does anybody remember Space Harrier 2? Never played it. And the Undead King is Alive asks, Is there any childhood games you played when you were young you wish you could play again? Um, I already have that. It's called Mega Man X. You'll definitely need the boots again. Yeah, I figured. Let's get Especially to get onto that plan. Oh, you're gonna take on the Stalfos again? Yeah, because if I try to wait, he's going to, like, sneak up on me or bother me, so I might as well just get him. You really do have a thing against undead skeletons, don't you? Well, these guys in particular, because I know that at the end of the game, you have to take out two of these guys while you're escaping the castle um, after defeating Ganondorf. Oh. And if you're not quick enough, one of them will reanimate. Yeah, and it's like, oh, shit, why? You were... You were way too late! Oh god, I got so wrapped up in that goddamn Stalfos. Well... Sayonara, everyone! Yeah. <laughs> so you might want to equip those boots. I just gotta make a personal reminder. Stalfos is coming back, isn't he? Yep. Yep. You called it. We'll do something, dipshit. Too old. You think bombs will help? I bet it would just... I bet it would just defend against the explosive. What is it doing? <laughs> do something, you moron! Thank you. I've never seen a Stalfos act... Like, consistently crouch like that before. Oh, it looks like people are sitting through ads again. Ah. Oh. Alright, well. Oh my god. Okay, and. No! Again. Ah. Yeah, just ignore the Stalfos this time.
Oh my god, that was a close one. Oh, great. And now we got some oh, no! silver ruby to collect. Ah, uh, was fucking. Oh, wonderful. Just what I need. Like, you can. I think. Or. Hang on, let me see if I can just. Damn it! Ouch. <clears throat> yeah. There's one more. Yep. And I think it's where that monster is. Yep. That eye beam creature. Yeah, I'm not gonna do that for a little bit. Not close enough. That one's close. Oh, there we go. Boom. And Toronto! That's where you gotta go. And whoop! Anything over here? No. I'm um, god damn it. Okay, do you have a fetish for throwing explosives or I something? Do. It's the fucking controller. <laughs> <laughs> I'm sorry. <laughs> Anything else over here? Okay, I see. You'll have to pull a block out of the wall, but you have to use the lens of truth to see where it is. Jesus. Is there any other way? Ah, here we are. There it is. Now you'll basically have to use that to shield yourself from those spikes. Those, yeah, those spiky chandeliers. Or as the sign calls it, the rain of blades. <laughs> Rather Do I even need the fucking boots on? No, you can take them off right yeah, now. Yeah, this would actually be very helpful instead of slip and sliding around like a moron. Alright. Kuba the Changeling asks, so Golden Fox is a real bomb chew from Majora's Mask? I don't know if I would... <sighs> you have to continue pushing it forward until the second set of blades is caught by the block. Shit. Damn it. Uh, fighting the camera. Yep. It's just, it's the, it's the clunky controls to make the da uh, camera difficult. Not the, like, the camera itself. Um, ooh, hang on. I'm gonna have to, like, find some way. Oh, man, this is gonna be a... Uh... You'd have to continue pushing it forward. <laughs> I mean, sure, but... Hang on. Now, of course, you don't want to push it too forward or you'll get caught in the spikes. All right. All right, you can start pulling it from the other side. Okay, I can thread the needle here. Good. <laughs> Hold on, is there something in those cells? Oh, I see yes, a Skultula. There there's, a, there's a gold Skultula. And whoop. Ow, I gotta raise that up more. Da, 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 wah, 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 wah. Yeah. Oh, damn it, my, my cut off on me. Oh, well. Right. There's another um cell you can enter. <laughs> oh. Yeah, that would actually help if I <laughs> da -da -da -da. arrows. Alright, now you gotta pull the block the rest of the way through. Alright. Thread the needle all the way. Well this one it's not even thread the needle, it's just Pull it all the way over here. All right, now you gotta climb on top. Ah. Oh. No. So I have to go over that. You can just hook shot over to that chest if you want. Or no, that oops. works too. <laughs> Either way, it works. Oh shit, Zuckerman's right, I need to refill my magic. Got a key.